Jamaican laws some people don't know. And I'll tell you first about the, the reasons when the police should not seize the vehicles because they don't have the lawful authority to do so. If you don't have a driver's license in your possession, the police should not seize the vehicle. They can prosecute you under the Road Traffic Act. Now there's a difference between not having a driver's license and not having, a, and, and not having your driver's license in your possession. If a person was never issued with a driver's license, that person clearly should not be driving a motor vehicle. What the police will do in those circumstances is that for one, the person will be prosecuted. If they find out that the owner of the vehicle allowed the individual without a driver's license to use the vehicle, that person, the owner, can be prosecuted as well. Otherwise, the police will take possession of the motor vehicle because they will not allow a continuation of the offense. They will take possession of the motor vehicle and will get someone who has a driver's license or the owner to come and claim that vehicle. We don't seize a motor vehicle for no insurance coverage. The person will be prosecuted, but they will, it is not a seizable offense. No registration of fitness is not a seizable offense. The police can lawfully seize your vehicle if you don't, if the vehicle is not licensed. There is a provision in law that is referred to as the month of grace. So one month after your registration expire, if you are within that one month period, the police should not seize the vehicle. Your vehicle can be seized lawfully if you don't have a regis pl registration plate affixed. So you're driving around with, with no registration plate, it can be seized. Or if the registration plate is so obscure that you can't see what's on it, your vehicle can be seized.